The installation of ground support in today's underground trackless mines has long been regarded as a bottleneck in the drifting and tunneling cycle. That is, until now. McLean Engineering, an Ontario-based manufacturer of specialized mining machinery, recognized the need for innovation in this process and developed the concept of the scissor bolter for the Canadian mining industry in the mid-1980s. Since that time, the McLean scissor bolter has evolved into the safest, most productive and versatile machine on the market. The bolting cycle begins with a sheet of wire mesh screen being positioned to the back or wall of the drip. The boom is set to the desired drilling angle and through the screen a hole is collared and drilled to the required depth. Hands-free drilling plus the fact that the operating position is underscreened and bolted ground ensures that the miner is never exposed to the hazards of falling rock during any part of the ground support cycle. The elevated platform also provides the staging necessary for proper assessment of back conditions and for safe, effective scaling of loose. Boom-tight bolters have neither the capability to screen or scale to acceptable standards. When finished, the hole is flushed, the drill steel retracted, and the boom indexed, ready for the installation of the ground support, in this case, resin encapsulated rebar. First, the resin is fed into the hole, either by hand or by tube applicator. Typically, a mixture of fast and slow setting resin cartridges are used so that the installed rebar will give immediate ground support. The rebar is now placed into the chuck of the rotation head and fed into the hole. During this part of the process, the resin is mixed. And allowed to set. Twenty seconds later, the nut is tightened to secure the rock bolt plate and screen firmly to the back. The boom is then retracted and repositioned, ready to drill the next hole. 
The McLean method allows for the simultaneous installation of bolts and screen on a single pass basis and the whole cycle takes only four minutes to complete. The design of the McLean system dictates that the bolt is installed immediately on completion of the drill hole, a safety feature in full compliance with today's accepted mining standards. The hydraulic functions of the scissor bolter with the transverse feed, rollover and crowd features of the boom allow for the easy repositioning of the drill feed to the next hole. For relocating the rig between drilling rings, a remote hydraulic drive system is used. This eliminates the need to start up the diesel engine at any time during the bolting cycle. Dependent on ground conditions and rock hardness, Holes to a depth of two and a half meters can typically be drilled in a minute or less. This means outputs of up to 60 resin bolts and screen in a standard eight hour shift are the norm and with friction bolts over a hundred. Indeed the productivity dividends from using the McLean scissor bolter in development bolting applications cannot be ignored and the installed quality of ground support consistently meets full design specifications. The deck extension enables the operator to be close to the boom and service the hole during the bolting phase. In its retracted mode during drilling, it allows for any dislodged rocks to fall clear of the deck and out of harm's way. Although most functions are performed from the main operator console, an auxiliary control pendant at the boom end of the machine is made available as a third hand for the miner during bolt installation. The rotation head shown here is for conventional rebar and mechanical anchor rock bolts. For friction bolt installation, a hammer feature is added to provide the required impact. Simple exchanges of the driver dolly enable more than one type of bolt to be installed in the same heading. This is a unique feature of the McLean scissor bolter. Its versatility in being able to install the full range of ground support hardware. The boom is able to cover drift openings five meters wide and up to six and a half meters in height from a single setup. The unit shown here is configured for a single pass drilling application, but with the addition of a hydraulic centralizer, the machine has the capability to drill long holes for cable bolts up to 15 meters in length. Service hole drilling for the installation of air and water pipes, fans and ventilation tubes is another regular function performed by the scissor bolter.
When bolting in the heading is complete, the boom is tilted into the deck to the travel position. The outriggers are retracted and the deck lowered, ready for cramming. Another securely bolted heading is ready for the next stage of the development cycle. The McLean Scissor Bolter. It has succeeded in combining the safety and benefits of mechanization with the irreplaceable flexibility of the miner, creating a unique product for the industry totally suited to this challenging mining application. For further information on this product, or if you have a unique application that requires innovation, please contact McLean Engineering and Marketing at our head office in Collingwood or Service Centre in Sudbury, Ontario.